Hey guys, so I'm here at the Exorcist 10 step banner, 5 step banner, and I will do my pulls for this and see if I get anything else along the way. And I will also do the rare ticket summons and whatever tickets I kind of have left over. So let's get started with that. And I'm here on my phone, not on the Amazon App Store. So silver book right away and so we have an MR card here's an MR unit Marguerite that's a good one I still need way more of her shards and she will be good for my fire team I now that I have a fire slash team I do want to make a fire mage team so she's gonna be good for that and here's our what it just upgraded to a UR. I guess that was a guaranteed UR. I'm not entirely sure. First step, let's go, baby. Should I stop here? Should I stop here? Let me get to step three. I'm gonna screenshot that. Let me get to step three because step three gives shards and you do get those uh, tokens. So that was actually amazing. Um. Jeez. So I do want to level up this card. Let's see. So Gill Snappers, that was an MR plus guaranteed. So it, it upgraded from blue to rainbow. We have Gill Snappers guaranteed on step two. We have Shards guaranteed on step three. Magicite. See, that's kind of where I'm kind of like, eh, Magicite? Like, what does Magicite have to do with a card? So let's keep going here and let's at least get to step three. I think that's going to be very good. Like we're going to get those shards. So the step three uh, visure is going to be worth it. And then here it's just a matter of if we get anything good. So let's see what we get. I think I'm still working on that card. And we're just going to go through all these blues and see if we get an upgrade here. That would be amazing if we get another Exorcist card. And we get an upgrade. Let's see what happens. Okay, two Exorcists. That is awesome. All right, so... Ah, yeah. So, no need to go to the last step. But if I do choose to go to that, then I do get some extra shards from that so continuing onward step three so so far all this has been fully worth it because we've gotten the card and then we got 25 shards now we're going to get another 25 shards so whatever we get here is bonus and i believe i will stop here just because of this amazing luck and i think that if I was to pull for Yuna, oh, gold book. So if I was to pull for Yuna, that might just be the shards. Um, I've kind of used up, no, it's actually the card. I've kind of used up my luck for that. So I have two MR cards. One is going to upgrade and one MR unit. And this first one here is the shards, of course. And MR unit, upgrade. No, no upgrade, Vistral. We have a maxed. But I think he he is just now getting EX jobs in Japan. So that is something to look forward to in the future. Now that we're going to get his Mind Spheres. So let's see what we get here. Do we get an upgrade? No, we don't. But we get Bloody Moon. I think I'm still working on that. I'm not entirely sure. That one's probably pretty close to max though. And let's see our upgrade here. Another UR. Is it going to be another copy of Exorcist? Let us see. Let's go three copies of Exorcist. I am sorry for whoever's pulling for this and didn't get it, but I just, I just took up all the luck, apparently. That is amazing. I think I forgot to screenshot the second one, but that's fine. Okay, so... 
we're gonna end there in that manner i probably should have switched over to the winter holiday party one but at this point i don't think i'm gonna have any luck on that so let's go back to the actually let's stay here in the summons and let's go to the rare ticket summons i have 49 i was one away from i think i already did my task for today one away from 50 but let's see what we get here and I, I know a lot of other people have way more shards, way more tickets saved up than I ha do. But I, I generally just save like a good handful, like 30, 40 rare, rare tickets, and then just kind of do them all at once. Just because like doing one at a time is kind of annoying. We get our girl Mary Luke, one person that we always tend to summon for some reason. Um, I guess the... The pulls must be recognized. That must be it. Here we go. We have our Mind Flare, which I am done with. I think I did spend Mog Metals to finish that off, but... Good to get that card anyway. Either way, we get Mog Metals for that. And this should upgrade here, and we get a unit of MR quality. And we get Durando. So, I think I'm getting pretty close with Durando. So, that's actually a really good one. And I think we did pretty good on that. Three MRs. That's not too bad. That's not too bad. So let's continue here. Do the next 10. And we will have 29 left over after this. So, so far already we have a white slash silver book. And we have two MR quality uh, pulls. So right away we get an upgrade. So that means the last one is going to upgrade. What do we get from this? Downtime. So I have this already. But definitely nowhere near maxed on that. So that's good. And continuing onward. Let's see if we get any other upgrades. Oh, there's one. And we got Katia. I don't think she's done. But I think she should be on LB4. So that's pretty good. And let's see the upgrade here. Let's see who we got. Is it Raldor? Is it Sakura? Let's find out. Ayaka. That's actually a pretty good one. So also get the Vision Sphere there. Uh, just got her to LB4. So I'm getting that much closer. Um, I don't have a fully maxed out primary job healer. I do have healers, aka Phoebe and Salir, but they're not primary. So the AI gets kind of wonky. So uh, I was working on Grace, but Ayaka has been kind of uh, becoming easy to build. So I did manage to get her to LB4. It feels like it was pretty quickly. So, wow, this is such a good summon right here. We have four MR and a UR at the end. Helena, very good. I'm still working on her. Another MR here. Durando, let's go. We got uh, the perks of having charm. I should be done with that. So, so far these MRs are, are lit. Like, another Durando. That's really good. Uh, he should be pretty close to maxed. Wow, another MR. Shell, very good, very good. Nasha, I think she's LB3 or 4, I'm not entirely sure. And we have a UR, please be Raldor or Sakura. Eileen, actually, another one that I'm getting pretty close with. The FFB event really helped for that, as well as Ayaka, of course. So that's pretty good. Let's see if we have anyone that went over Perks of Fighting Charm. So we're still not there with Durando. Does this show the amount? No, it doesn't. So I'll, I'll check that later on my own. All right, so next one here. What do we have going on for our next 10? We have a silver book. That's really good. Let's skip this and let's see if we get any upgrades. So it's going to be an MR card at least. Let's, I don't expect any upgrades here after that last really good one. So that is pretty awesome. And let's see what we get. Does it upgrade? It upgrades. Please be Shiva, please be Titan, Diablos, um, Typhon, I think it's called, the wind one. 
any of those, please. Let's go something new. Oh, no. I thought it was something new because it kind of lagged there for a bit, but I guess not. So I, I think I, I haven't maxed that out yet. So that's a pretty good one. All right. So for our last one, we only have nine. Let's light that one off. Brown book. Uh, I kind of had the feeling that not having that 10th one was going to kind of give us bad luck, but it happens. All right. So we have all nine are blue. Let's see if anything upgrades. Nothing so far. Oh, we got an upgrade. So at least we got something. Let's see what we got. Yes, Marielle. That is amazing. That is amazing. I, I'm still working on her. I'm actually trying to... I actually threw her into my barracks. So speaking of which, let me just go hop in and show you guys. Now that we're done with all those rare summons, I'll hop in and show you guys real quick. And then I'll jump back to the rest of the tickets. So I'm basically working on my light slash team. Somehow I put a Yaka onto here. I don't know why. I guess I thought she was light, but she's not light. Uh, she should be at 40 shards LV4. So I really don't know why I put her here. But now that she's at six hours, I'm just going to wait it out. And of course, I threw in our boy Titus. Cause, just because he's new, we need some of his shards. So let's go back to the summon screen and go to our ticket summons. I still have, oh, here's an MR plus guaranteed summon. I think that's from the crossover event. So let's use that up right now. So they're both 10 times summons, which is good. And we have our silver book from the guaranteed MR. Let's just skip the animation here. Doesn't look like it's gonna upgrade past MR, but that's fine. I don't know why they do that. If it's gonna be guaranteed MR, why do they why do they make it upgrade at the end? Unless that first one was the guaranteed MR, and this one is just generic uh, blue stuff. But I think it's gonna upgrade. There we go. And what do we get? Let's go. Who is this? Oh, Alhim. Yes. Nice. All right. Good. Good. So actually. We all have shards for her if we did the um, the quests, I guess. So that's actually a really good one. Helena looking pretty good, considering that we summoned her again. Oops. Um, so she should be pretty close to max. It's a bummer that I didn't get to use her for the raid because she was actually doing pretty good for a lot of people. Or at least the people who weren't using like the the regular, you know, Stern, Venera, those the the really hard hitters for raids. All right, here. So we have an up, not an upgrade. We have a MR at the end, and we have an MR at the beginning. Uh, let's see what we get from that. Salir, she's maxed, but that should give us mind spheres. Okay, if she gets EX jobs, 100% taking her to EX jobs because she is she has been a very good unit to me. And she's, I think she's cost, she's extra cost or maybe her shards just cost more. But she's, she kind of gets good treatment is what I'm saying. So I think she'll get um, a good upgrade to her moves. Okay, so continuing onward here, we have a bunch of blue stuff. Nothing special here. And what do we get here? Grace. Actually, so I'm working on her, so that's a good one to get. Uh, I think she's at about 100 shards away from LB5. So that's going to be a pretty good one. All right. So before I do the rest of these, I also saw that we had the Mont mind sphere tickets here and i hope hopefully we can do all seven at the same time if not i'll just do this one i think this is just one because obviously we, we're all gonna get mont so this is not really anything exciting so let's i'll do that at a different time 
All right, so going back to here, we still have a bunch of stuff. These were the tickets from before, and this first one is actually the one from today, so let's do that one. That should be one summon. So I guess it's like one, then two, then four, something like that. Is this guaranteed you are? I don't remember. So are we gonna get an upgrade? Yes, we are. And who do we get? Mashari, everyone's favorite. <laughs> Obviously joking there, but I don't have her max, so I'll take it. Uh, so let's see. Uh, I don't know if I want to read this. 50 king burst pots, I assume that means. I think this is going to be two, so let's see what it is. Does it say guaranteed you are? I don't really know. All right, let's keep going with this, and we'll see what we got. All right, so gold book, so it might be guaranteed you are. Uh, probably not then, or maybe it's just one guaranteed you are. So we have a regular card and a UR card. Please be Shiva or Diablos. Downtime again. The, you know, I, I think it's pretty clear that well, maybe it's not clear, but I just start noticing patterns and it feels like there's almost definitely a seed built into the game where, you know, certain people tend to get certain cards more than others, certain cards and certain units. I don't know. This is just kind of me. This is how I feel. I don't, this isn't based on anything, just how I feel, just because I see myself getting certain cards and units a lot in the MR Plus. Oh, 300 Gill Snappers. That is really good. In the MR Plus, so I just have a feeling that sometimes the, the RNG isn't as random as we think. That might be different factors. Who knows what, exactly what it is, but it just doesn't feel as random as it should be. Uh, but let's see, so we have four cards here, and they're all going to be blue, and no upgrade, no upgrade, but we have an upgrade at the end, you already know what I'm looking for, let's go, Lucia, she's maxed, next up, <laughs> darn, sometimes I just wish I can just look into the future and see what I'm going to pull, and then not work on those units because certain units I tend to pull a lot, aka Rain, aka Lucia, and even Nivlu. Like Nivlu, I pulled for, but I ended up getting her like three, four, maybe five times afterwards from pulls, and that kind of that helped me finish building her. But at the same time, it kind of made me feel like, man, maybe I shouldn't have gone for her. I did get her within 8,000 Vizier, so that wasn't too bad. But, like, at the same time, I feel like, man, come on. All right, we have a brown book here. And there's an upgrade at the end. And let's see if anything else upgrades. Probably not. And then we will... Oh, we have an upgrade for Fina. And no upgrade here for another Fina. Okay, so that should give me all minus spheres because I just finished her recently. And I get a rainbow, three rainbow fragments of thought. I feel like I have a lot of those saved up, so that is a very good thing. Um, and last but not least is our day seven, which should be the best one, at least in terms of the amount of summons. So, gold book, don't remember if that's a guaranteed you are or not, and we have two MR cards. Little Leela, we got Chocobo, which I have maxed already, another Little Leela, another Chocobo, what's going on here? Big Leela, Big Leela, let's go. Ramada, I have her maxed, Sosha, Vistral, I mean Vel Velide, Velide. Belo, do we get an upgrade? No, and another UR unit. Is it gonna be a repeat? Or is it gonna be someone new? Not even a repeat, just someone that's already maxed. 
is going to be someone that's not maxed or someone new. Stern is not maxed. Very good pull. He is getting ex. He has his ex job unlocked right now, so that is a very good pull. All right, so I think we are done there. Let me just go into my units and check my Durando. He should be very close. One more Durando pull and he's done. And then we have Queen Helena. She should be very close. Two more pulls and then some and she'll be done. And then who else? Who did we just pull? I already forgot. Oh, geez. Oh, it was Stern. <laughs> Stern is now on LB4. I will upgrade him right now. And he is awakening four. So he should be able to get to level 70. And he's actually going to be pretty usable pretty soon. Uh, but looks like his faith, his bravery is pretty low. I was using him for Trials of Reckoning at some point. And I just ran down on auto, so he must have just died a lot. So there you have it. Well, we're going to end there. I know my videos are always long for no reason. So let me just stop it there. Thank you guys for watching. And I hope you guys were able to save some stuff and were able to get some mind spheres out of that. All right, guys, I will catch you in the next video.